It's the most wonderful time of year for a street styled London edition. Excuse me. Hi. Can I talk to you about your style? Hello, hi. How are you? I'm Robin. Welcome back or welcome to my YouTube channel. This little world right here is a very festive London, but this is also a man for himself. If you like hair product reviews, grooming, skincare, fragrance, and videos like this very one, then first of all, tell me, comment down below, and also make sure you've pressed subscribe. Now, Street Style sees me out on the streets talking to guys about what they're wearing and their grooming choices. And in this one, I am very pleased to be working with MSI and their limited edition Creator Z16, which you're gonna hear a little more about later on in the video. Come on, let's go. The guy has just gone in here. <laughs> Although he might work here, let's see. What a win, a Christmas win. Hi, Hi. how are you? I'm very well, thank you. What's your name? Uh, Casper. Casper, nice to meet you. I'm guessing you work here. Yeah, I do, yeah. I chased after you and then I thought I'll just chance it. Um, you look very cool and also very tall. Thank you. <laughs> Where's everything from? Um, this jumper is an old Pendleton jumper from a shop. It's actually shutting just off Brick Lane. These trousers are from Clutch Cafe on Great Portland Street okay. where I used to work. Uh, and these shoes are Red Wing Blacksmiths from here, where I work, okay. yeah. And what about grooming? I have to say, Casper smells amazing. What are you wearing? Uh, Creed Aventus. Oh, Creed Aventus, there we go. And what about some hair care? I mean, this hair is something to behold. <laughs> I use um, Quicksand by um, Hans Fuko. Yeah, and uh, I get my hair cut by a guy called Dan Gregory at uh, Regal Gentleman, okay. yeah. Very good. Saying all the right things here. I love this. And um, what are you going to be wearing for Christmas? Do you have a Christmas Day outfit ready? Pajamas. Pajamas. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much all day. Yeah. Theme of the day. Very good. Thank you very much for stopping. Hi. Nice to meet you. Hi. What's Hi. your name? My name's Thomas. Thomas. Thank you for stopping. A vision and a very bright vision on quite a cold day. I know. It's pink. <laughs> it's pink, and we love it. Um, tell me, where's everything from? Um, so this is a Henry Lloyd consort jacket, which I got off eBay. I think it's from the 80s. Okay. This is a corduroy shirt from Uniqlo. This is an old Marks and Spencer jumper. And then these are some FU's jeans, which are from the 80s, which I bought in a charity shop. I love that. Dead stock. Amazing. Absolutely. And these are old Adidas, which have also got pink stripes on them. Okay, there's a, there's a, there's a theme here. What are your glasses? They're cool. These are just new. I got these from Moscot around the corner. I've literally just been and picked them up. Okay. So you're saying all the right things. Saying all the right things, and they've they've passed the test. Yeah. So, so do you have any like style inspiration? Is there anywhere you look to? Um, old magazines. Yeah. Just old stuff, generally. Not really. I mean, I just see what people are wearing around. I don't really, I don't really think about it. I just, I mean, I just buy stuff that I like. I live in East London, so I spend a lot of time mooching around in vintage shops and just looking at old stuff. Um, and I'm a historian, so you spend a lot of time looking at, you know, like old style magazines or old like photographs of people from the olden days, and you kind of get into that, and then sometimes get kind of obsessed by. I get obsessed by particular things. So like I went through a. F I mean, at the moment, I'm kind of obsessed by these coats. Mm. So these are an old sailing jacket that was then redesigned by Olmos Caretti, who's an Italian designer, because they became popular with Italian kids. And so there's a whole bunch of them that came out. So they're kind of collectible, but they're very, like it's the type of thing where you can get really geeky about it. So you're like, oh, this one's pink. It's got slightly different pockets. It's got a different lining in it. I've got another one that's a different color with a corduroy collar, all that sort of stuff. So it's just easy. I get kind of, you know, slightly obsessive about yeah. things. Yeah. And as a historian and someone that loves style, is there like an era that you think, oh, I would have loved to have been around then? Like everyone just, you know, like this kind of thing, you think, oh, I'd love to go back and see, you know, people in the 60s, like we're on Carnaby yeah, Street, oh, I'd love it when we were, you know, like swinging the 60s and see, you know, the shops down here. But I think sometimes it'd be amazing to go back even further, yeah. you know, like the 19th century when people like Oscar Wilde were around mm. with like all their, you know, velvets and all the rest of it. Hi, Hello. nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm Robin, what's your name? Samir. Samir, I stopped you because I like your look. <laughs> Thank you very much indeed. Where's everything from? We've got Uniqlo, we've got Debenhams last year in the sale, which means I've got a jacket for £20 instead of £120, which is always a win. Oh, it's a win. Um, and then a jumper from Egypt, actually. Oh, yeah? yeah? Yeah, it's a bit of everything. Okay. And what about your glasses? Glasses, uh, Ray-Ban. How would you describe your sense of style? Um, a little older than my ears, maybe. Okay. <laughs> yeah, no. Um, just, uh, depends what the day is, really. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And what, what do you think makes London kind of unique in its, in its style and fashion? 
I think because of the the style of London, um, every, everybody's just a lot more free to, to dress how they might want to, or just be a bit more extravagant for uh, for, what, for for want of not being judged as such. Because I think everyone just goes to the extreme, so that's always really good. James, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Robin. I love your look. This vision in, should we call it like tomato? What's what's this color? Yeah, I guess it is tomato, isn't it? This is the coat that was left at my mum's home when I moved to Spain okay. a year ago, and I've just come back and picked it up, and it's like, oh, I think I'll wear that. Yeah. You just came back for the coat? Uh, just for the coat, yeah, and I got a comment on the street today, someone saying they were jealous of the coat, so it obviously worked. Oh, you've got your second comment of the day. Uh, where is the coat of dreams from? It's from Jigsaw. Okay. Actually, I bought it on a shop near High Street, Ken, mm -hmm. about eight years ago, I think. Yeah. And where is everything else from? So we've got Jigsaw. Uh, my jeans are from Addicted. Mm -hmm. um, yes, Addicted. Um, and my husband runs a shop in Valencia, so okay. anyone that wants to get out there, you know. Okay. Uh, and my shoes Adidas. I wouldn't be wearing these shoes if I wasn't only here for the weekend, but you can only bring as many shoes as you can fit in a, a hand luggage. Yeah, I mean, you should start checking it on. What, what kind of boots or shoes would you normally be wearing? With this, I'd probably wear, with this coat, I'd probably wear a smarter shoe or at the time of year, maybe a little boot, like a Timberland sort of boot, something like that. Very nice. And what about grooming? You are a guy who's very well groomed. Do you have a special grooming routine? Any favorite skincare products or hair? No, I'm pretty easy on that. I like to get my hair cut regularly or like a bit like yours, leave it longer. They're kind of in betweens hard. So if not, I like to get it cut regularly. Um, just like a nice, regular skin cream yeah. uh, with an SPF okay. um, and try and, try and keep my beard trimmed. Okay. Um, I like to shave it off sometimes because it definitely takes me years okay. off when without the grey. Yeah. Um, and yeah, that's it. Just try to look after, eat well, eat well and drink lots of water okay. to make up for the wine. Thank you. Thanks very much. Just on time. Now, this is the brand new limited edition Creator Z16 from MSI in collaboration with Hiroshi Fujiwara. Now, this is all about fragment design and this is the perfect collaboration, not only for them, but also for us. You are guys that like style, you like fashion, and I'm guessing you like a bit of technology. Now, Fragment Design was founded by Japanese artist and designer Hiroshi Fujiwara. Essentially, it's high-end design with high-end performance. And since it began, he's collaborated with some huge brands like Maserati, Rolex, Nike, Louis Vuitton, and MSI. And with these tech specs, this really is setting the gold standard for how a laptop should perform. It's got a golden ratio display of 16 to 10 and mini LED panel with a power performance, true pixel technology with QHD resolution and a mini LED. And not to forget the backlit keyboard and touch panel experience. Check out all the details for the limited edition Creator Z16 in the description. But while I'm sitting here, I am missing some guys. So back to the street I go. Hi, how are you? I'm good, you? Yeah. I'm good, thanks. What's your name? Angelo. Angelo, I love your look. Thank you very much. Can you tell me where's everything from? Uh, the coat from Zara. Uh, my pants from Boohoo. Yeah. Uh, my scarf, Zara as well. My hoodie as well. And my shoes is a raffle from Nike. Yeah. That's it. And my hat from Nike. A classic Nike. And do you have any sort of like key inspiration or any designers you really love? Uh, uh, people inspire me a lot. It's probably Odell Beckham Jr. Okay. Because, and, and Chris Brown as well. It's like the same vibes I like. So, yeah, that's the people who inspire me. Thank you very much. Dwayne, I love your look. Thank you. Thanks. Where's everything from? Oh, uh, it's a mix, mix match. Like this coat, um, I love this. This is actually from ASOS. Yeah, yeah so ASOS, bags from Reigns, my hat's from Weekday, so okay. very high streety. And that. this is like a roll neck that I would wear. Where can I Where can I get this from? Um, I think I got this from, what did I get? Cos. Cos, this is a Cos jumper, yeah, so. 
Yeah, it's my bag. <laughs> um, and what do you do? What kind of do you work in fashion? No, I work in tech. So ah. um, do a bit of IT. I'm just always on my laptop. My okay. laptop's in my bag. Yeah. Work anywhere, really. So yeah. <laughs> tech on the move. We're actually talking a bit about um, technology and design. Do you think the like how important is it for you for technology and design to sort of marry up? Is it something you kind of look to? Yeah, definitely. Um, um, people are very conscious about what technology they go for. If it looks, it matches everything else. What about um, your grooming? Do you have any sort of skincare products or any hair care? Is there any, or fragrance? Is there anything that you really love? Um, yeah, fragrance wise, I like um, uh, Pen Elegans. Um, also have um, a bit of Diptyque as well. Nice. So um, I like different smells, not just your everyday, um, whenever someone smells it, they're like, what is yeah, that? Because yeah. it's very obscure, so yeah. What Pen Halligans ones do you like? Um, oh, I don't even know what the main one I have is uh, the stag, the stag one. Oh, I can't remember the name oh, of it. From the portraits collections. Yes. 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 Yeah, yeah. Lovely. That's my favourite yeah. one. Yes. Yeah. And uh, Dwayne, for Christmas Day, what are you doing and what are you wearing? Oh, oh. I mean, I have Christmas at home with the family, so I don't usually dress up that much for Christmas. It's very home comfort, um, and you know, maybe a matching top and bottoms, okay. just casual, very yeah. casual. Yeah. A little Christmas cord. <laughs> Um, exactly. I love a cold. Love a cold. So um, usually on my day to day, you'll see me in matching top and bottoms usually. So, yeah. <laughs> well, thank you very much for stopping. Well, I lasted that long. But top tip from man for himself himself is if it's raining, get yourself an oil based product on. A little oil based pomade today. Moi, Moi Seth, nice to meet you. Nice to be here too. I'm Robin, lovely to meet you. Um, where in Spain are you from? I'm from Alicante. From Alicante, oh, lovely. Yeah. Probably a little brighter and less wet than here. Yeah. Where's everything from? So the sky is from Agnex Studios. Mm -hmm. So the choice is like from Vintage Shop. Okay. This is as well for like a leather bomber jacket from Vintage Shop. And then I'm wearing like a double oh, press nice. suit, like yeah. blazer from my grandfather. Okay. Does he know you've got it? No, I have no idea. <laughs> okay. You just nicked it. What about your grooming routine? You've got lovely hair. To be honest, I didn't do my hair this morning, but I usually put so much yet gel and then I, I just brush to the back. Yeah. Any skincare, any favorite fragrances maybe? Not really. I'm so upset with the perfumes. I'm always wearing like Paco Rabanne 1 million. Okay. I'm yeah. always like wearing like boarding heel, just in case you're spraying it. <laughs> what are you doing for Christmas? Are you here? Are you going back to Alicante? Yeah, no, I, I'm spending Christmas here because I have to work, so I have no time to come back home. Okay. No time, no rest for the wicked. What are you going to be wearing for Christmas? Have you got a little Christmas jumper, sitting in the pyjamas? Uh, I'm thinking I'm going to wear something like sparkling jumper. Yeah, because I'm having like dinner with my friends. Okay, so the dress code is like sparkling, shiny. Yeah. So. I've got some sparkling shining. How do I get an invite? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Awkward. <laughs> yeah. Everyone, this is Matt. We've spoken to Matt before. Matt's a barber at Joe & Co. Still a barber at Joe & Co? Still a barber at Joe & Co, yes. Yeah, for my sins, yeah, yeah. Also yeah. friend of the channel. We've had you on before. <laughs> OG of the channel, yeah, yeah. OG yeah. of the channel, I like that. <laughs> Where's everything from? So we go Pata, um, which has just found the corner, which is lovely. The jumper is from Maharishi. The back's more amazing. Um, the T-shirt is from my friend Sam, who has a, a label called Nancy, which okay. is amazing, nancysucks.com. And then uh, Carhartt jeans Love with that. Pata. Uh, Reebok shoes, yeah. yeah. It's a kind of streetwear. You're always vibe. very well dressed. <laughs> I try, I try. It's You're really a guy awesome. that might know this. Have you heard of Fragment Design? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. okay. Yeah. So we're working. So Japanese. Yeah. yeah. What do you know of it? Uh, they just did a Nike collaboration, I think, mm. for Sak Sakai. Yeah, yes. kind of Japanese um, yeah. sort of streetwear brand. It's yeah. uh, Hiroshi Fujiwara. That's right. Yeah, and yeah. he's got um, a new laptop, which is a collaboration with MSI. Oh, wow, uh, amazing. So oh. We have got that on here, and you will be seeing more of that a bit later Incredible. on. Incredible. I'll be buying that then. Oh. <laughs> That's more money spent. What are you wearing for Christmas? Um, uh, where, what am I wearing? Probably not a lot. Okay. Probably, yeah. I'll, okay. I'll pull out, uh, maybe I'll find a fragment onesie and... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Bracing the elements to give you a rundown on my look. My coat is from Shot. This has been under my bed for a year, uh, but I got it out thinking it would be pretty good for a very wet and windy street style. My roll neck is from Select Hom. My jeans are another one I've not worn in a while. Uh, these are Tiger of Sweden. And then a little bit of an 
urban hiker, I'm going to call this, from the North Face. They are waterproof, but I'll tell you at the end of this if they really are waterproof. The gloves had a lot of love from Street Style Paris. Not the last one, but the one before. These are just an ASOS. And then my favourite bag, little Marbury, just enough room for a microphone and into the skincare. There's a lot going on today. i uh, using a toner by Chanel. I've then got a Polish Choice Hyaluronic Acid Serum, an under eye by Allies of Skin, and then Murad, moisturizer with an SPF 45. And into the hair, it's wet, so I've got a traditional pomade. It's Easy Tiger by Sheer Revival. And the umbrella is from a pound shop. This was a pound, and it's lasted really well. Five years and still going strong. Jazz, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, man. I love your look, a vision in green. Thank you very much, I appreciate you, man. Where's everything from? Uh, this is the jackets from a brand called AA Spectrum. I okay. think they're based in like Beijing. Uh, the leather jackets from Couples. These are from a, a thing called Sun Set, Sunrise or okay. Sunflower. They're Sunflower and New Balance. That's it. What with the hat? Cos. Cos. Good look, isn't it? I really, when I saw the colour, it yeah. looks like mohair. It's not mohair, yeah. but it was like thirty pound. I feel like it was a good, uh, good buy. It's a vibe. I feel like I couldn't pull this off, but you certainly do. Oh, I appreciate it. That means the world. To me. You are most welcome. And what have you just bought? Uh, I bought a pair of shoes and a belt. Okay. Yeah. For you or a Christmas present? No, for me. For yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. The kind of shopping that I also like. That's us. It's the best kind, isn't it, really? Where do, where do you get your sort of fashion sense, sense of style from? Is there any inspiration or anyone that you like to look to? Um, I'm not actually like really into it, if I'm yeah. honest. I like, uh, there's some places that I like to go to a lot, but um, I don't know if I've, it's like a, a main interest yeah. of mine. So just whatever feels comfortable or right for however I'm feeling energetically in any given moment. And what about any grooming choices? Do you have any favourite like skincare brands or a favourite fragrance that you go to? Uh, yeah, Pen Halligans is my favourite. Uh, I wear uh, basically just that. Uh, skincare, all of that stuff, I'm super basic, so okay. I wear absolutely nothing but cocoa butter. Okay. And I wash my face with soap. Okay. So. Hi, how are you? I'm very good, thank you. I'm Robin, nice to meet you. What's your name? Uh, my name's Joe. Joe, lovely to meet you. I stopped you because I like your sense of style. Thank you very much. Where's everything from? Uh, this is Ben Sherman. Mm -hmm. uh, and then I've got a shirt on from Jaeger, I think the brand oh, nice. is. And then these Zara and my boots are Doc Martin. I love this. This is like a full vibe. This is like party ready. Are you going out tonight? Yeah, I am going out tonight. Okay. Yeah, going for drinks. Very yeah. exciting. Is it some sort of Christmas celebration? Just a general celebration of life. Uh, yeah, just. Drinking, just a general eating. weekday. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. General, what day is it today? We're on Monday, yeah. yeah just Monday, your general Monday, Monday. Monday. <laughs> Monday vibe. I love this sort of hair, like 90s, sort of Kurt Cobain yeah, sort of yeah, vibe. Yeah, very that. Um, very wannabe Leonardo DiCaprio, but like Ooh, a kind of uh, failed version of that. Okay, I love yeah. that. Not Fail. with the roots done. I'm getting my roots done next week. I want to emphasize, not very good at the moment. Failed rooty Leo. <laughs> yeah. I like that. Yeah. What's your sort of style inspiration, or do you do you have any sort of favourite celebs that you look to? Oh, uh, definitely Alexa Chung, um, Emma Chamberlain. Okay. I love like '90s, yeah. '70s style. Yeah. A bit of rocker, but kind of softer version of that. Yeah, a bit preppy as well. Just yeah. kind of a bit of everything. Whatever works. Yeah, exactly. What about grooming? Do you have any favourite skincare brands or fragrance? Oh gosh, uh, fragrance. I use the Isemiyaki uh, Intense, and then. Skincare, like cow shed moisturizer, that's it. Not, yeah. I'm not a massive skincare, clearly. Um, yeah, that's all. Yeah. What, yeah. what are you doing for Christmas and what are you going to be wearing? Ooh. Uh, I did actually get my new Christmas party blouse um, at a vintage shop in Hackney. It's like a red, it's got like a massive bow on. Love this. Um, and then, yeah, that's kind of my go to Christmas outfit for now. So I'm going to wear that Christmas yeah. Day uh, while the family. Um, yeah. yeah. I feel like we need to see this. Do you have an Instagram where people can check in on Christmas Day? <laughs> <laughs> I do have an Instagram, yeah. It is um, Joe Gardner, like J J O E G A R D N E R. Love that. Um, and you can all see the promote famous, it. Yeah, no, go for it. <laughs> famous Chris Party Blouse. Love um, it. Yeah. Well, thank you very much for stopping. So Lovely to talk to you. Well, it might be cold and wet, and my hair may have just about given up, but London has most certainly brought the Christmas cheer. Yes, it has. Thank you very much for watching. Really hope you've enjoyed this one. Everything, and I mean everything, is linked below in the description. Also, a link to the limited edition Creator Z16 by MSI. If you're still new to this and you've still not pressed subscribe, then hey, go on, give me a Prezi. Press subscribe right now. The button is just there. So also more video suggestions under there and more videos up there. The hairography is on point. But until my next new video, bye-bye.